just got off the phone with a guy who watches the channel. He says, Craig, I got this car, you're gonna want it. I'm gonna bring it by, I want you to either buy it from me or see if you can sell it. Let me show you what it is. I'm like, yeah, cool, what do you have? He's like, no, no, no. Let me show it to you, I'll bring it by, I live a half an hour away. I have no idea if it's good, if it's bad, you're gonna find out just like me, and I don't know, it might be a complete disappointment, but we're gonna find out together, and I don't know if it's worth the video, maybe it's not, maybe it is, we're gonna find out together. So hopefully it is. A few minutes later. He just called and said he's a moment away, so I'm gonna do some satisfying tape peeling while we wait. Wonder if I can hear him before he even shows up. I have no idea what to expect. I hear something. Do I hear something? Oh man, I hope this is it. I hope this is it. Look at that thing. Wow, that is sharp. I can only assume this is the car. This thing is cool. And it looked great pulling in. What you have here, what is this thing? It's a 1996 uh, Yukon GT, all original from California. I've owned it for six years. They updated it with the suspension, new Boston shocks, all new brakes, rotors, rims, tires, 17 piece front end kit. So you got Yukon GT. What makes it a GT? Is that it's two door? Um, no, it's, it's an option. I assume it's like the color matched fenders, yes. color matched bumper is what you're getting, two door obviously. As well as the, uh, that came from the fact with the Bill Stein jack. Oh, it came with Bill Stein, so, okay. Yep. And then these are, they look like 22. Uh, 22 inch uh, black. Denali chrome. wheels? 2020. Black chrome. The, the frame is amazing on it. We don't get these from New Hampshire. Why is this so clean? It came from California. But I don't drive it where it's at. I like the wheel combination, the wheel tire package. This looks great. Exhaust, obviously not the factory exhaust. What do you have for exhaust here? Uh, Magnaflow. All right. Stainless Magnaflow, Magnaflow. stainless steel, dual exhaust. Yep. Cool. Engine, 350 LT1. Correct, 5.7. No modifications. Completely stock. Original air box and all. AC pump looks brand new. All right, let me try it out because it is hot as a mother today. We're on a heat wave and this car is like an ice box. Oh man, look at this. It's a time capsule. It is a time capsule. Original CD, original cassette. Dash is not cracked. Steering wheel, not worn. Let me see if the, let's see if the door rattles. Oh, it shuts tight. Center console's in good shape. Passenger seat, armrest, amazing. Wow, cool speakers. Headliner, small rip right there. Little bit of sagging right here, but not terrible for the year. This isn't stained, it's not sticky, it's not gross, and usually they are. 158,000 miles. It's the original mileage? Yes, right 158K. This seat, is far too nice to be original. Has it been reupholstered? Yes, it has. It matches well. So this is original, this is reupholstered, yeah, right? This, is, the, this the whole, is new. The whole thing's been done? Everything else is original. Wow, these rockers are so clean. And the underside, holy moly. Wow. Yeah, those wheels really, uh, really made this truck look good. Can you pop this glass for me? What do you guys think? I don't even know what this is worth. I have no idea. I know it's not a square body. Square bodies are up in value, but these are getting up there too. Spare is still there, still mounted, extra parts, full flat bench seat. I wish these were removable. What do I mean by removable? Wouldn't it be cool if you were driving around in a Tahoe with no roof? Like that Escalade right there, that, that truck was my motivation to make that truck if those were in convertibles. If I found a cheap one of those, I would have cut the roof right off that, but I did that instead. Let's get back to this. So you said you had records for it too. Do you mind if I look at them? Right 
And this is obviously a secondary vehicle. You, uh, it doesn't look like you drive it regularly. Third vehicle. Third vehicle? All right, so do you mind if I go through this stuff with you? All right, we'll start here. You have the Monroney label. Original window sticker with options, 31105. A new Tahoe or a new Yukon would be triple that right now. So that's funny how much they've gone up in value, how much they've gone up in price since new. Your exhaust, 750. We have Bilstein shocks front and rear for 1,000. How long ago did you buy this thing? How long have you owned it? Six years. Six years from California. Did you drive it back here from California? Yes, I did. Three days. All fluids look like they were done at 134K, so just over 20,000 miles ago. Carfax, two owners, no accidents. You're the third owner though, right? Correct. So first owner bought it in 96, second in 2002. You bought it six years ago, so like 2015, 16-ish? Yes. Around that time? Ago, yeah. Okay. Yeah, California, California. California. Wow, that's cool. It also points out that this is a California vehicle up here. Here's brand new. Yes. 1155 for the tires, mounted and balanced, NATO tires. The alignment. alignment on it. Oh, there it is. California, California plate from 2016. That is cool. It's funny, these are the original floor mats that came with this, isn't it? No, it's got a frequent design. me actually selling this. I just thought I'd never part with it. It is a keeper. It's a cool company, but all toys must go. And then once you sell it 10 years from now, you're going to I wish I had that Yukon. Yeah, this thing's awesome. Here's the question What is it worth? I have no clue. I know they're up there. I've been at auctions where I've seen this thing go for 15, 20 grand. What is this thing worth? Let me shut it all so you can see. All right, here's the thing. I can buy it. I can consign it, meaning I sell it for him. I can, maybe even one of you guys would want this thing. If somebody knows, First of all, what they're going for. Like real, don't give me like low ball offers. I don't even want to hear it. I get those on Facebook Marketplace all day. If you guys know what these are worth, like a real enthusiast, let me know. If you're interested in buying it, hit me up on my website, www.flying-wheels.com because I mean, if I don't have to sell it and one of you guys want it, I can pay it forward, move it on to one of you guys and I'll just give his information over to you. This thing, really, really cool. Well, fun, quick video. If you want to see anything else specific about this vehicle, hit me up, let me know. If you're interested in this vehicle, also, let me know. I'll give you the buyer's info or I'll work it out between the two of you or something. I just can't get over how clean the undercarriage is. We don't have those like that up here. I can help even arrange shipping if somebody's interested. So this isn't something I wanted to just let pass by my fingertips. If somebody's interested in it, hit me up. Tell me what it's worth. I have no idea. You guys reach out to me and tell me if you're seriously enthused by these things. Come on, get it. Make it yours. I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Adios.